Hi everyone, so if you can hear a little bit of a weird noise it's because it is raining on the roof right now but it's not raining too heavily so hopefully the noise won't be too bad and I'll just speak a little bit louder. But today's video is going to be an empties video and I'm quite excited because I haven't done one of these in forever, I can't even remember the last time I did an empties video. So I'm just going to run you through the products that I've used up. The lighting might be a little bit strange as well because as I said it's raining and dark so I've got the artificial lighting on but it kind of can make you look a little bit washed out and weird and I'm also having an extremely bad hair day I think it was due to my vigorous workout this morning um, but I'm gonna start with hair care products so the first hair care product that I finished is the Charles Worthington front row um, rough and tussled salt spray which looks like this and this is just like a texturizing spray I've spoken numerous times about how much I love these types of products I do like this the only thing I don't really like about this is the scent I feel like it's got a slightly manly scent it's totally empty you can kind of hear just the little remaining tiny bit that won't come out it's got a pump applicator which is always handy with these types of products but it's got a little bit of a masculine scent it's a very masculine scent in fact so I'm not um, overly keen on the scent but apart from that it is a nice product and it's quite readily available and it's cheap then um, the other hair care products I've got here is a shampoo and this is the Umberto Giannini Frizz Bad Hair Day Smoothing Shampoo which looks like this I really like the packaging of these the kind of bullet um, lids are really cute but I did like this um, when I first started using it I really liked it my hair then got used to it and it didn't really do that much but to be honest I don't ever find that any shampoos wow me so it wasn't too much of a problem for me but it is a nice product it's just it's not outstanding and I'd probably try a couple of different things before I repurchase this then um, I've got two candles here that I've used up. These are both tea candles. They're both Kringle candles, which I absolutely adore. They're my favourite type of candle company at the moment, even better than Yankee. The first one is the coconut and pineapple candle. And you can see here I've burnt that completely. This is what the lid looks like. And it's just a really beautiful, beautiful fragrance. It's just smells like tropical pina colada in summer it's amazing and I've got a couple more of these to use up because I love it so much and then this one I haven't burned all the way down but something happened to it and it just won't burn anymore so I'm going to say that it's burnt because it just doesn't work I know you can melt the wax and everything but I'm not bothered enough to do that but this is beach side and it's a really nice kind of fresh scent really kind of nice and um, it's a nice like bathroom scent I think it's quite fresh and uplifting then I've got a body butter here that I've used up. This is the Bodylicious Coconut Scented Body Butter, which I have completely, completely used up, empty. I love this. Um, I buy these from the pound shop. I've got another one on the go at the moment, but the coconut one's just lovely. They're really inexpensive, nice to just kind of smother all over your skin if you get dry skin, and a kind of nice winter treat. Then um, I've used up a shower gel. This is the Aromatherapy Associates Revive Body Wash, completely empty. I did like this. I did feel like I went through it really, really quickly though, so for the price, I don't think it's that worth it. Um, but it's a nice treat if you want something a little bit more luxurious. Then I've got a face wash here that I have been trying to use up for the longest time ever, and it's the Dr. Darren Mekon AHA Active Radiance Cleanser, empty. I really didn't like this, it just didn't do anything, it wasn't particularly nice texture, it didn't brighten my skin, I didn't feel like it was very active and I definitely wouldn't repurchase this again. Then I've got a hand cream here that I've used up, this is the Burt's Bees Be Lovely Hand Cream. I used all of this up, I love how this smells, I smother my hands in it before I go to bed and it just smells like kind of sweet oranges and it's just a very very easy go-to type of product that will nourish your hands and doesn't leave them too greasy. And then I've also got here, I've almost finished this, I've got about one more application of this, but this is the Sun Labs Refreshing Exfoliant Body Gel. And it looks like this, so you can see I've got just a tiny bit left of this that I will probably use next time I put fake tan on. But it's good to just kind of pre-scrub your body um, before you put fake tan on, and it's good because it doesn't have any oils or anything in it, so it preps your skin for the tanning process. And then, last but not least, I have the Aromatherapy Associates De-Stress Muscle Bath and Shower Oil. Completely empty. I'm keeping the bottle of this because it's beautiful. 
but I absolutely love these. They are quite expensive, but I think they're totally worth the money. The scent you get from these is incredible. Um, my boyfriend, who's not even into products or anything like that, says that these are amazing. And I told them, I told him how much they cost, and you know how men can get funny about the price of things. And he just sort of said, "Well, they're worth it because they just smell so strong and they so relax you, and it's just fantastic." So I definitely, definitely recommend these. They'd be nice as like a Christmas gift as well if you were into that type of thing but that's it those are my empties for this month um let me know if you want me to do more empties i know i hadn't done them for ages but it was just because i was kind of getting bored of them but i thought it was just something a little bit different so let me know if you want me to do more and let me know if you have been good and been using products up and what the last product you used up is and i will see you all in my next video bye